Hey everybody, welcome to the channel. Welcome to Rob Squad Reactions and another episode of Rob Squad and the Creators. We are so, so lucky to be able to do this. Now, these amazing guests on our channel, but before we get to that, if y'all are new here, you are here as always with your boy Jay. Hey y'all, you're also here with your girl Amber and we've been with our new friends, Bob, Susan, and Paul, or the Cow Sills. And today they are back. We are so, so lucky to be getting another Cow Sills classic to react to. Please welcome back to Rob Squad and the Creators. Castles. Round of applause, Yay. everybody. Thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with us. Rob Squad. We yeah. Long time and no we see. hear that uh, long time no see. <laughs> we cannot thank you guys enough again for coming and hanging out with us. You guys have been such an awesome guest. I mean, very, very easy to talk to, being on here, being able to discuss stuff, have fun and laugh. We're yes. honored again. And, you know, we've we had you guys, all, we've had you guys all week and, you know, we got the live performance. Get me down to their hair. Your little night longer hair. Here, baby, their mama. Everywhere, daddy, daddy, hair, 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 hair. Like I said, I feel honored because not many people get this uh, uh, kind of pretty much a one on one <laughs> live performance. So we are excited to have y'all back in the studio today. And we hear you have a, a song that we have never heard before. We're uh, kind of wondering what you got for us. Who wants to start? Well, in 1968, we needed a hit, and uh, we'd have the rain, the park, and other things. And we can fly, which made it top ten. <laughs> But we needed a hit, and they came to us with Wes Farrell, who had produced, and Tony Romeo, who had written a song called Indian Lake. And, uh, you know, our reaction to it was sort of like, eh, whatever. Uh, but we ended up going into Susan is going to tell you <laughs> she loved it uh, as an eight-year-old. So as an eight-year-old, maybe the brothers were That's one of your kids. <laughs> yeah, maybe we don't want to like what the eight-year-old <laughs> likes. I don't know. If your sister likes it, maybe not. Our <laughs> oldest brother really hated it well, until he heard that Brian oh, Wilson yeah. and the Beach Boys loved it, and then all of a sudden my older brother tolerated it as well. These are your hints. So it's it's a fun Oh, well, one more thing, may I? Uh-huh. We, um, in 2023... For the very first time, the Cowsles became controversial and were asked to not perform this song at a casino out on the Happy Together tour. Just all these are hints for you guys. You'll get it. Um, you decide for yourself okay. why perhaps they wanted us to not. Uh, we still do the song. We take out uh, per certain parts of it. Um, well, it's an Indian casino. It's we'll called Indian Lake. Okay. The yeah. song is Indian gotcha. Lake, and it's about a fun place to spend your summer. Right. Good summer song. That's all it's about. Promise. Here we okay. go. Yeah. I, 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 yeah. I, I'll say, I was trying to think about the, the like, oh, God, we have so many casinos here in Oklahoma. Yeah, we, we have no time. <laughs> but we are ready to jump right into it. Make sure you guys like the video, hit that subscribe button, and turn on that post notification bell so you never miss a video. Cow Sales Indian Lake. Let's check it out. Heavy bass. I, I love bass. Where the air is fine with the sweet smell and pine and the countryside pretty. And you see that good deal down the lake for a hundred love mama bear. Just take a look at the bridge and the quick and town bridge. And in a minute you're there.
I, I love it. Uh, I'll say one thing about us. We love to go like kayaking down the river. Like this is like, this yeah, is yeah, one of those yeah. like chill, fun, easy listening kayaking type songs that, that you can literally just lay back and listen to. I love, love floating. I love sitting in my backyard in my hammock. And like, this is, I would even put this on my hammock song, but I want to talk about this. The whole family dynamic to me again, is still really, really cool. I didn't get to ask him, ask you about it in the last video. But like just the power of like having a literal family, all you guys together at the same time, like did that help you guys get through the good times and the cha challenging times as well? Musically, it was nothing but a positive. Right. I mean, musically, we have six people and the vocal stack is great and all that. And being with your family is is, is mm -hmm. great. Yeah, it's wonderful. But you know, there's six kids in the operation and we're all teenage guys. And you're trying to get away from your family a little bit, you know? And we can't. We can't. <laughs> and that's his perspective. Mine is. Well, you, you got to match them. <laughs> yeah. My perspective is I have them all locked in a bus with me. They're all mine and I can get to them. And yes. they that. That's my perspective. You understand, Amber, Polly? <laughs> oh, I'm, you know, actually. Yes. Uh, no, I, uh, I relate say, oh. to you so much on that. It's like, yeah, you can't get away from me. And it bothers you, but I still have you. Because her brothers have told me stories about her. She, she just tormented them. So. Well, you know what it's like to be a younger sister. They tormented us as well. Oh, you're the younger sister. They agree. They don't ever say they didn't. <laughs> what was your perspective, <laughs> Polly? Uh, my perspective basically was that, you know, through all the years, um, the, us siblings had each other's backs, you know, um, and, and without that, you know, it, it probably wouldn't have been any fun, at, have all. Been any fun at all. But, yeah. you know, we were we we kind of were our own best friends kind of thing, being that we traveled so much. It was for Susan, Barry, John and myself. It was hard for us to really have any long, endearing friends because uh, we were never in school. So, you know, we didn't build those kind of friendships. Yeah. So, but we had each other and, you know, mm -hmm. and here we are now in our 70s, yeah. and 60s. And, you know, uh, that still holds true today. Yeah, it's the deal. We have each other's back. And so we, we feel like we can do anything. Yeah. See, that that's so cool because you, you don't have to you don't have to worry about other people trying to trying to Correct. do something behind your back. You you know you got well, family there, try, family there you trust. There's something special and about isolation with your siblings, even though that sounds terrible. I grew up in the country and we had no other friends. Everybody was yes. so far away. So when you you're the only friends that you can play with and talk to are your siblings, there's the, there's this love. There's yeah. so so much love and understanding there. It's like I got nobody else to play with. So right. this is what we play with all the time. So I also, I know, is that your mother in the video as well? Yeah, that's mom. Oh, yeah. that's so cool. Now I love it because, because this song makes me think of um, what it would feel like to just be packing up and going to the lake for the weekend. Yeah. You know, yeah. like packing your sandwiches, packing the cooler, hopping in the truck, driving around the lake and just finding your nice little, that's what it feels like. It feels like that happy feeling when you're a kid, you know, you're about to spend all day out in the sun and in the water, and it's going to be the best day ever. That's what it feels like. And, unless it's our family, then it would be like, what are they called, the Griswolds? Oh, yeah. <laughs> on, on, the, on their camping trips. <laughs> Everything would go wrong. We, it, we have two older girls and a little boy, so the dynamic <laughs> is reversed. <laughs> well, right, let's, get back, let's get back to it. Yeah, let's get back to it. You can swim in the car. What, what the what the fuss is about, but I like it personally. And I'll, I'll say, not being being my my grandmother is about ninety percent Indian, and and like, yeah, you know, I don't know. I, I I enjoyed it. it yeah. I thought it was a, a fun upbeat song. Well, I should say that your two reactions, yeah, both of your reactions to it when I listened to it, 
it was basically telling me why the thing was a hit record. There you, you know, go, it was Bob. A, a good summer there song. There you go. Yeah. 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 It was good. Yeah. A, a summer hit, no doubt about it. And, yeah. and I'll say, and you know, every summer, you know, you didn't know, didn't know where it comes from, but someone will put out a, a summer banger and it'll just completely take over exactly. you know, almost all genres of music yeah. just for that yeah. summer. And, we and, won and the that's lottery that, one that felt summer. Like. Oh, I see. Then, yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah. It's like everyone's battling for that summer song. Yeah. yeah. Susan, I have to say, I got to learn those dance moves. <laughs> I got to have them. <laughs> Just that study so hard, Amber. Guys, <laughs> thank y'all. I got from Davy Jones of Fred the Monkeys. I'm going to have to go check it out now. I have to have all of those moves. Come on, you can do it. Guys, thank y'all. You guys have been such... An awesome guest to have throughout the week here on Rob Swan Creators. Yeah. Uh, before we go, hey, no problem at all. Before we go, guys, we'll have all their uh, links down in the description. They're on tour right now, currently in Georgia. So, guys, go down there, click on it, check where they're, check where they're uh, performing at, and make sure y'all go send us a picture while you're there, too. Yeah, Absolutely. we can do that. And we're going to want to get you two on our podcast. We have the Council's podcast. We have a podcast. Would you be our guests? Oh, yeah. no, no doubt about it. No yeah, doubt right. about it. You guys also have a, I thought you, I read that you guys do radio as well, like 60s and oh, 70s. Yeah. Music. We have a radio show uh, every Sunday, a weekly radio show. You can download the app 97.9 The River. It's based on our podcast because we have a lot right. of great guests with a lot of history going on there. So it's a pretty cool thing to listen to. Sweet. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much. Thank as you, we God. always send our people out of here. Thank we love you. you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every single day that y'all wake up, it is a blessing and that you are blessed. And for your new family members, to hit that subscribe button down below. We welcome y'all to the RSR family, but y'all have a goal every day just like we do. Let them know, Ma. All right, y'all. Let's spread some light. Let's spread some love. Let's go out in this world today and just try to make somebody smile. Amen. We love you guys. Till next time. Oh, Castles. Thank y'all. Till next time. We'll see you guys later. Any play you sing, you should make with your little Keep it in mind.